Hi, my name is Bob Grinier, and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project, and I'm here with Jan Rack. Introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Jan Rack, and I'm a head of the uh, kind of private uh, laboratory here in uh, Nelahozeves, close Prague. And uh, what we are doing here is that we are developing the uh, EVO experiment based kind of similar of uh, what maybe you know the what is SAFI experiment, right? So it's, it's related to the um, evolution, kind of the generation of the uh, small uh, ball lightning in the vacuum chamber. And what you see here is the power supply, which we are kind of uh, prototyping. So it's not the final one, but that's the version of what we are kind of trying to test for the experiment. So the core of the power supply is a a uh, nice transformer, uh, which uh, is, uh, uh, you know, it will be run at the frequency of uh, 3 to 4 kilohertz. It's, uh, you know, supplied from the PDM, uh, which we are now working hard to get a, a computer kind of, um, you know, interface such that we can steer and drive everything from the, you know, the interface. Then uh, there will be an um, auto transformer which will uh, help us to kind of adjust the voltage. And the output from, from that uh, goes through the grass rectifier into the big uh, capacitor bank, which is uh, of order of 250 uh, microfarad. And, uh, you know, the voltage up to 4000 volts. So we are just testing it. Uh, it's a, uh, you know, I so, hope. so the aim is to do something a bit like uh, Hank Kieran has been doing with the Baker experiments. Right, it's it's very similar, but I think uh, we aim that the power supply will be more powerful. This this system will be able to provide about twenty five kilo ampere volts. And the idea is that you'll be able to control it and understand what's going in and when. Exactly, and we want also to, to, to have a full monitoring of that, so we will be measuring all the current voltage and, and pulp width and, so, I don't know, so ripples on the voltage. And, and this will all go to uh, central kind of um, centralized machine, which will be also monitoring all the, uh, you know, the vacuum chamber, the currents and, uh, you know, temperatures and so on. So. Uh, we are thinking, we are kind of building now the central system uh, which will be uh, used to run the whole experiment. And so I was discussing with you this morning that once you run up, up and running, it would be great if you could take part in Project Zeus. Yes. Which is uh, aiming to reclaim the Thunderbolt from Zeus mm. for humanity. That's correct. <laughs> And uh, this work, along with the work of uh, David Boulier and Hank Uren, mm -hmm. I think uh, we'll have a good chance of uh, doing just that, right? <laughs> that would be, I think, uh, that, that's my dream. You know, I spent more than 30 years at, the, in the, at CERN, you know, at uh, Geneva, this, um, you know, uh, Centrum for Nuclear Science and so on. And uh, I think now we are getting close and close to some real science. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Thank you, Jan, for that overview of Thank you. Thank your you power supply.